Okay, what we have here is a house that <clears throat> is a big house and the boiler is on the opposite end of the house and the room's over the garage up here are always cold and slow to heat. But the boiler's on the other end and what happens is when this happens, when this situation occurs is the boiler is heating and the radiators closer to the boiler are going to get their heat first and uh, satisfy the thermostat before the steam actually makes it to the end of the building. And so what we do is we put in an airlock system. And this works great on two pipe steam. Now you can see up here is a steam pipe that goes to the radiator over the garage. And in there what we did was we cut in a Gorton 2 main vent. And let me get over here, get up here closer and you can get a better view of this. We put a main vent here because the steam is going to go looking for the vents, right? And we're going to airlock the return pipes. See, there's the main vent on the radiator going into that second floor. And this is a sensor, okay, and that will play part, I'll explain that in a little bit. But this wire here, which is left loose because the pipe's still got to get insulated, um, is, is a sensor that's going to sense the temperature when the steam gets to this pipe, because this is the farthest run. And we want to make sure steam is here before the rest of the system is allowed to breathe. Now over here on the other side of the garage is uh, another radiator, but it's on a shorter run, so the sensor went on a longer run. And we cut in a, a main vent onto this pipe in the garage also. And what we're doing is we are going to make sure that the steam comes out of the boiler, follows the main, goes up, goes around, goes over to that main vent, goes around, all the way around the garage in this cold garage, gets over to that main vent before the rest of the system is allowed to breathe. That way none of the radiators in the house will be allowed to work until steam is verified to be in the garage and at this end of the building. And this is how you airlock the return pipe. You put a Kalepi zone valve, which is rated for steam, in front of the air vents. And that way those air vents cannot work until that zone valve is powered. And it won't get powered until that sensor in the garage says, I'm happy, that it's got heat out there. On a steam main, you can see the steam main, there's nothing in front of the vent. So, so the steam main will be allowed to breathe and distribute the steam throughout the building, but the return pipe will be airlocked, it'll be closed, and the radiators will not work until steam is all around the house first. There's another air vent station. Up there is the two Gorton 2s, and then Here's the zone valve put in front of this one. They just clicked the relay! Alright. Definitely tell when it opens. That's a huge custom. There we go. Yeah. This is the control system for the airlock. System is 24 volt transformer off the power supply and a Tecmar 150 set point control. This is what controls the electric and when a sensor is tied into this and when a sensor gets happy and says I'm at about 180 degrees, it closes the relay and then the 24 volts goes to the zone 